Hi and welcome to the video tutorial of Shopify multi vendor marketplace app. In this video, we will learn about the commissions and commission settings. Commission in multi vendor marketplace app is uh, admins, that is your share in each seller order. In our app, you can set individual commission, which is on per seller basis, and can also set product wise and category wise commission. So let's get started. Firstly, we'll click here on the commission setting. Clicking on which we will be redirected to this page, which will show the list of all the sellers and their commission and commission type. As you can see here, we, we can see the seller number, seller, email ID, commission, commission type, whether it is in percentage or fixed, and action to edit or delete the particular commission. Now, let's just see what happens when we edit a particular seller's commission. We will just click on to here on the edit button and the admin that is you can edit the commission type you can change it if from fixed to percentage in case required and you can change the commission amount and submit it the commission for, for seller y has been successfully updated from percentage to fixed now uh, in case you want to add a commission, you simply have to go here on add commission. Type the email ID of the seller, then commission type and amount of the commission and click on the submit button. So I would just like to take you back again. On the commission setting, you can see these uh, various uh, tabs wherein you can enter the value and you can search by clicking on the filter button for a particular seller's commission and its detail. In case you want to delete a particular seller's commission, you simply have to click here. Do you really want to delete the commission? Action cannot be reversed is the warning and you simply have to click on the delete button and the particular selected seller's commission will get deleted. Coming on to commissions. Clicking on the commissions, here it will get displayed the list of commissions, order number, date, product name, quantity of the product, the actual price of the product and the unit and total commission. So from here, we can have an idea of uh, what all products have been sold, what is the price of the product, what is the unit commission and total commission for the particular product. and uh, in case you want to search any particular product's detail, you can simply type the product order number and you simply have to click on the filter button to search for that particular product. So that was all in the commission and commission settings. Thank you for watching us and keep following us for more videos. Thank you so much.